City at homecoming this year. His future plans are to go to college and play football and basketball. Number five, Maurice Alexander. Maurice is escorted by Lynette McAlpine and Hassan Haskins. His favorite memory is when he got Defensive Player of the Year his junior year. His future plans include attending a four-year college and playing football. He hopes to major in business. Number six, Austin Evans. Austin is escorted by Ken and Lori Evans and Bill and Amy Rumping. His favorite memory is catching a TD pass at Webster Groves this year. His future plans attend Mizzou. Number seven, Tyler Turnbull. Tyler is escorted by Keith and Stacy Sparks. Tyler's favorite football memory is beating Lafayette and scoring the touchdown to put us up 12 to seven. His future plans include attending Missouri and majoring in business. Number eight, Luke Thustin. Luke is escorted by Steve and Joy Souter and Patrick and Arlette Thustin. Luke's favorite football memory was when he started his first varsity game playing linebacker at Webster Grove his, his sophomore year. His future plans, he hopes to attend college, play football, and major in education and administration. Number 11, Michael Perez. Michael is escorted by his father, Steven Gomez. His favorite football memory is playing the best football he has ever played at CMSU. He hopes to go to college to become a teacher and then enter the fire academy after college to become a firefighter. Number 14, Art Mueller. Art is escorted by Art and Shirley Mueller. Art's favorite football memory is beating Lafayette this year. Art plans to go to college and play football. Number 18, Jim McLarty. Jim is escorted by Jim and Sharon McLarty. Jim's favorite football memory is homecoming against U City this year. His future plans, he hopes to study for a degree in architecture. Number 19, Corey Smith. Corey is escorted by Mike Smith and Kathy Clagus. His favorite football memory is his first kick against Lafayette. Corey plans to go to college and hopefully kick. Number 21, Greg Van Patten. Greg is escorted by Dave and Cora Van Patten. Greg's favorite football memory is his interception against Roosevelt this year. He plans to go to Mizzou and be a great success. Number 22, Antonio Evans. He is escorted by Levon and Perkins. His favorite memory was when he was a sophomore and scored five touchdowns in one game. His future plans, he hopes to attend a four-year college, play football, and study criminology. Number 26, Dominique Willis. Dominique is escorted by his mother, Lavana Perkins. His favorite football memory, when he made a one-hand interception against U City and ran it for 26 yards. He plans to attend a community college and major in business. Number 33, Josh Smith. Josh is escorted by Coach Sumner. His favorite football memory is the entire senior year. He hopes to go to Missouri Valley after high school and major in business. Number 43, Brandon Richards. Brandon is escorted by his parents, Linda and Bill Richards. His favorite football memory, winning at Webster Groves in 2006, his sophomore year. His future plans, he hopes to attend the zoo and major in pre-law. Number 50, Jacob Pitts. Jacob is escorted by John and Jan Pitts. His favorite memory, when he stripped the ball right out of the running back's hands and ran it for a touchdown. His future plans include attending college and running his own business. Number 54, Ryan King. Ryan is escorted by Dave and Lisa King. His favorite memory, Ryan's memory, is his sack against Jackson this year. He hopes to go to college and pursue a career in engineering. 
Number 55, Jim Kirkwood. Jim is escorted by Sharon Scott Roper. His favorite football memory is flipping tractor tires in the offseason with his linesmen and other teammates. Future plans, attend college and major in business. Number 57, John McClemens. He's escorted by Carol Boyd and Karen McClemens. His favorite memory, his freshman year and getting to run the ball in practice, seven yards a carry. Future plans, go to college, major in education. John wants to teach history. Number 58, Dennis Granger, escorted by Alice and Dave Granger. Dennis's favorite football memory is going to CMSU for football camp. His future plans, to attend technical school and become a mechanic. Number 61, Ryan Harts. Ryan is escorted by Russ and Judy Harts. His favorite memory, if you can believe this, two-a-days. And his future plans, to go into the Air Force or the Naval Academy. Number 66, Miles Fryman. Miles is escorted by Brenda and Rob Fryman. His future plans include attending Murray State University in Kentucky and majoring in business. Number 73, Tyler Kozlowski. Tyler is escorted by his parents, and he'd like to also indicate his sister Megan and his brother Aaron Bentley and Ryan Bentley. His favorite memory is finally getting the chance to play Lafayette and beating them. Future plans include attending college at Ball State University and majoring in communications. Tyler would also like to launch snap there. Number 77, Getty Miller. Getty is escorted by Tim and Sandy Miller, his favorite memory. He enjoyed his long, long talks with Coach Sumner. Future plans to attend college and major in music. Number 79, John Bolden, escorted by mother Deborah Wilson and dad Nathan Bolden. Also wants to indicate his brother, Sean Bolden. Favorite football memory last year when he was down with a heart problem for all year. All of, the, all of his bros were there to support him. Future plans to play football in college somewhere and get a good job. And finally, Coach Sumner. Ladies and gentlemen, Coach Sumner has decided to retire from coaching after this year's season. Since coming to Eureka High School in 1990, he has been the line coach for the football team and run the weight room. Every day he is in the weight room from zero hour to after school helping every student, whether a football player or not. Due to his hard work, the weight room has become the best in the area. Tonight, in 2008, Tonight, the 2008 football team is presenting Coach Sumner with a plaque, dedicating the weight room to him. Thank you, Coach, for all your hard work and dedication to Eureka High School. Big round of applause, please. Andy's award is presented by the Bino family. Bill, Gretchen, Laura, and Teresa. The family has also established the Andy Bino Scholarship Fund, which honors graduating seniors who demonstrate dedication, leadership, and community service at Eureka. The Bidos and the entire Hit Squad family would like to thank all those who stay after tonight's game for the presentation of this year's Andy Bido Homecoming MVP Award. And we're ready to present that award now. Please give your attention to the center of the field. The award this year goes to three players. 
Luke Thurston. And number 22, Antonio Evans. And number 14, Art Mueller. Congratulations. Folks, that's about wraps it up for tonight, except for these pictures being taken. Next week, the Cats play Parkway Central at Central. That's Friday night, October 10th. Our next home game is October 17th against Jackson.